Well, singer-songwriter Dami M is one of our homegrown artists taking to the road with some new music, and here is a taste of her new single, Lonely Cactus. Fantastic song, uh, great film clip too. Dami M joins us now from Brisbane. Dami, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, I've been dying to ask you this question. This is a great song. It's a compelling video clip. Why cactus? Why cacti? <laughs> well, uh, last year I became really, really obsessed with cacti and, you know, we all had a lot of time to be stuck at home and I did as well and I decided to write a song about, you know, a cactus. I, I wanted to include that in the song title and basically it's about this person who is feeling really lonely and wanting human connection but at the same time being uh, really annoyed at everyone and also wanting to be by themselves and being all prickly. So it's actually uh, a story about a lot of people that I know in my life, but also about me as well, because I get I can get prickly and just, surely, surely not, surely not. <laughs> just while we're talking about about <laughs> the the song, Dami, it's a really great song. I love the film clip filmed in Brizzy. You can see lots of story bridge there. Where did you film the cactus bits? Because that is a stunning cactus garden. Yeah, so the cactus video uh, I got to film in regional Victoria at, at the end of last year, actually, and I was there uh, at the cactus cactus country. Um, it's a really, really incredible cactus farm, and yeah, it's just cool. got tons and tons, thousands of cacti. Beautiful, like just I was in heaven and I loved it. So you, you guys should go visit sometime. It's incredible. I'm there. Hey, uh, it's been, it was a challenging year, as you've just alluded to, for, for so many people, and uh, especially artists like yourself. Last year, things are starting to look a bit different this year. You're at the Adelaide Festival, I believe, next week, ahead of other opportunities. How, how excited are you about the prospects now opening up for live music and for singers like yourself? Yeah, look, I mean, we're still you know a long way from a full recovery mm. but yeah i'm just so excited that things are starting to bubble up and starting again so yeah i'm doing the adelaide festival i'm doing some solo shows in new south wales um and then i'm playing at Byron bay blues fest so you know these big events are starting to pop up again and yeah music is starting to happen so i'm really hoping that the music scene, the live live scene can recover soon and people will really get out and support all the amazing artists in the country. And, and Dami, you are first and foremost an incredible singer, an amazing songwriter, an incredibly accomplished pianist, but we also know you so well from uh, things like Eurovision, from X Factor, from Dancing with the Stars. Can I just ask, do you have a preference? Do you prefer doing the writing and recording and performing music or do you like doing the, the telly stuff? Look, um, I think, you know, writing songs and making music and performing is like, you know, something that I would love to do every day and, you know, that's my bread and butter, I would like to believe. But then everything else that I get to do, like, yeah, Eurovision and getting, you know, dressed up and um, anything that's a bit different, I'm, I'm up for a good challenge. So I'm not so sure about the dancing part. I don't know if that was a good idea, but... <laughs> Anything other than that, <laughs> I don't. Yeah, I'm. I'm happy to give it a give it a go. <laughs> Good stuff, dummy. Uh, so much. Uh, looking forward to seeing you. I know I have lots of fans uh, waiting to see you at the Adelaide Festival. And uh, go well and all the best with the new single. Thanks so much, Michael and Maddie. Thank you very much, dummy. M.